Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Daniel Rosal here bringing you another video today on uh, camera accessories. And I wanted to show today an interesting audio setup I'm currently using to record this video with. Um, firstly, the microphone, I'll start with that. A Audio-Technica AT875R, which is a short shotgun microphone. It's not really intended to be used as I'm using it like an interview mic, uh, but it is a terrific short shotgun. There aren't that many of them on the market I could find. Um, I recently bought the Canon XA40, which is a really compact camcorder, and so I wanted a shotgun microphone that wouldn't uh, kind of overwhelm the camcorder. So it's a really, really great microphone, uh, really happy with it. But that's what I want to make the video about. Um, I recently picked up an XLR wireless pair from uh, Lakato, and I went for a pretty budget XLR wireless system. That's what the top part you can see here, that's the transmitter, and the receiver is going into a uh, direct plug-in XLR to my XA40, uh, about 60 centimeters in front of me here. Now, what I noticed about the XLR systems is you can get ones that can deliver phantom power. In fact, Uvive, which is the intermediate component, do actually make one. The Uvive uh, U3C, C standing for a condenser, that's a XLR plug-in wireless system capable of delivering phantom. But the cheaper ones on the market, um, and I went for a, this Lakato MK5 thing, is definitely a, on the cheaper end of the XLR wireless systems. They typically won't deliver phantom. So what, what happens if you want to use a microphone that needs phantom, such as the uh, Audio Technica I'm recording, speaking into, which needs 48 volt of phantom power, but your XLR pair doesn't support phantom. And that is where the intermediate piece in this rig comes in. It's the U Vive, and I'm going to actually just kind of turn around so you can see I'm using a really short XLR cable to keep this all tied together. It's the uh, U Vive P1. And what this is, I did not know that these things existed um, until I Googled on Amazon something like Phantom Power Injector. In other words, some kind of an electronic that its only purpose was to add phantom power into the receiving end and then pass through uh, the audio signal. And this is just basically all it does. So basically it's a battery. Um, it has an input and an output side. XLR on either side. So I'm connecting, you can see, the XLR transmitter directly into the output terminal here on the uh, on the P1. And then on the input side, it's just that short shotgun microphone leading up into the into the, uh, into the microphone I'm speaking into. You've got 12 volts and 48 volt of phantom power and an on-off toggle. On-off toggle, and that's all it does. It's a simple piece of gear, no need to make it complicated. It charges up over USB type C, and there you go. So basically, the, the point of this video is, if you have a microphone that needs phantom power and you own a uh, XLR wireless system that doesn't deliver phantom power, you're not out of luck. You can buy yourself a Uvive P1 and that can go straight into your transmitter. Um, and that will inject phantom power into the microphone coming into the wireless transmitter and then you'll be able to get it working perfectly recording into your camcorder. Hope that was helpful if, you've, uh, if you're in that sort of uh, dilemma or uh, that's your situation. Uh, this was about $50 on Amazon.com and uh, definitely I think a super useful thing to have in my audio bag going forward. Thank you guys for watching. If you'd like to get more videos from me, please feel free to subscribe to this YouTube channel.